Have you ever pondered about the benefits of glutathione? If not, you're about to discover something fascinating. This naturally occurring compound, often referred to as the master antioxidant, is a powerhouse in our bodies, playing a crucial role in numerous biochemical and metabolic reactions. In this video, we're going to delve deep into the world of glutathione, exploring its numerous benefits and potential side effects. We'll also discuss why this antioxidant is so important for our health, how it supports our immune system and its role in detoxification. But it's not all sunshine and rainbows. We'll also shed light on the potential downsides of glutathione, including its side effects. Finally, we'll walk you through the dietary considerations you need to keep in mind when taking glutathione. What food should you avoid? What should you consume more of? We'll answer all these questions and more, so are you ready to unlock the secrets of glutathione? Buckle up, because here we go. Glutathione, often known as the master antioxidant, plays a crucial role in our body. But why is it so important? Let's dive into the details. First, let's talk about its detoxification prowess. Every day we're exposed to a multitude of toxins. They're in the food we eat, the air we breathe, and the products we use. Glutathione acts like a natural vacuum cleaner, sweeping up these harmful substances and escorting them out of our bodies. This shields our cells from damage and keeps our organs functioning optimally. Next, let's look at how glutathione supports our immune system. It strengthens our body's defense mechanisms by promoting the production of disease-fighting cells. When we're battling an infection or illness, glutathione is there front and center, boosting our immune response and helping us recover more quickly. But that's not all. Glutathione is also a key player in the anti-aging game. As we age, our bodies naturally produce less glutathione, which can lead to increased oxidative stress and cellular damage. By maintaining healthy glutathione levels, we can combat these effects and support healthy aging. It's like having your very own fountain of youth right inside your body. Furthermore, glutathione is involved in numerous cellular processes from DNA repair and protein synthesis to enzyme activation and amino acid transport. It's like the multitasking wizard of our bodies ensuring everything runs smoothly and efficiently. Lastly, it's worth noting that glutathione has been linked to improved mental function and reduced risk of chronic diseases. Studies have shown that it can support brain health, potentially warding off conditions like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. Meanwhile, its antioxidant properties can help keep heart disease, cancer and other chronic illnesses at bay. Clearly, glutathione is more than just another molecule. It's a health powerhouse. It's the unsung hero of our bodies, quietly working in the background to keep us healthy and vibrant. So, the next time you hear about glutathione, remember, it's not just the master antioxidant. It's a master of many trades. But like all good things, glutathione too has a dark side. This master antioxidant, while celebrated for its health benefits, isn't without its potential pitfalls. Let's delve into some of the possible side effects you may encounter when supplementing with glutathione. Firstly, some users report experiencing abdominal cramps. While not particularly dangerous, this discomfort can be somewhat off-putting. It's always essential to listen to your body and adjust your intake accordingly if you experience any discomfort. In addition, allergic reactions are another potential side effect to be mindful of. While these are relatively rare, they can be severe in some cases. Symptoms may include rashes, swelling, and in severe instances, difficulty breathing. If you have a known allergy to any ingredients commonly found in glutathione supplements, it's vital to steer clear. Overconsumption of glutathione is another risk. While it's a naturally occurring compound in the body, taking too much in supplement form can lead to an imbalance. Overdoing it could potentially lead to a decrease in zinc levels in the body, an essential mineral necessary for numerous bodily functions. Furthermore, there's also a potential concern around the use of glutathione as a skin lightening agent. While it's true that glutathione can inhibit the production of melanin, the pigment that gives our skin its color, the long-term effects of this are still largely unknown. Some studies suggest that long-term use for this purpose could potentially lead to skin damage and other health issues. Lastly, it's worth noting that while glutathione has been deemed generally safe for consumption by healthy adults, more research is needed to determine its safety for pregnant or nursing women, children, and those with certain medical conditions. 
In essence, like with any supplement, it's crucial to remember that moderation is key. Always consult with a healthcare professional before beginning any new supplement regimen and monitor your body's response closely. So, while glutathione has numerous benefits, it's important to be aware of these potential side effects. Now that we've discussed the benefits and side effects, let's dive into the dietary considerations for glutathione. To boost your glutathione levels naturally, certain foods can be your best allies. Let's start with cruciferous vegetables. These include broccoli, kale, cabbage, and Brussels sprouts. They're loaded with sulfur, a mineral that plays a pivotal role in the production of glutathione. By incorporating more of these into your diet, you're essentially giving your body the building blocks it needs to produce more of this powerful antioxidant. Next up, we have allium vegetables. This group includes garlic, onions, and leeks. Like cruciferous vegetables, allium vegetables also contain sulfur compounds. They not only help in the production of glutathione, but also aid in its activation. Then there are lean proteins. Foods like chicken, turkey, and fish are high in amino acids, particularly cysteine and glycine. These amino acids are essential for glutathione synthesis. By including lean proteins in your meals, you're providing your body with the necessary tools for glutathione production. Now let's look at the other side of the coin. Foods to avoid. Processed foods, especially those high in fat and sugar, can deplete your glutathione levels. They increase oxidative stress in your body, which in turn uses up more glutathione to counteract this. Similarly, excessive alcohol consumption can also lower glutathione levels in the liver, where it's most abundant. But remember, it's not just about what you eat, but also about maintaining a balanced diet and a healthy lifestyle. Regular exercise, for instance, has been shown to enhance glutathione production. In conclusion, by incorporating cruciferous and allium vegetables along with lean proteins into your diet and avoiding processed foods and excessive alcohol, you can optimize your glutathione levels. It's about creating a diet that provides the necessary nutrients for glutathione production and minimizes the factors that deplete it. By incorporating these dietary changes, you can optimize your glutathione levels and reap its health benefits. Before we wrap up, let's quickly summarize what we've learned about glutathione. This powerful antioxidant, also known as the master antioxidant, plays a vital role in our health. It's a tripeptide, made up of three amino acids, cysteine, glutamate, and glycine. Our bodies naturally produce glutathione, but its levels can be boosted through certain foods, supplements, and lifestyle changes. Glutathione's primary job is to neutralize harmful free radicals in our body, it also aids detoxification, boosts our immune system, and can even help slow down the aging process. It's been linked to preventing chronic diseases like cancer, heart disease, and Alzheimer's. Moreover, it's been known to enhance skin health, giving us a brighter, more youthful complexion. However, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. There are potential side effects to be aware of, especially when taking glutathione as a supplement. Some people may experience mild gastrointestinal issues, such as bloating, cramping, or allergic reactions. It's always crucial to consult with a healthcare professional before starting any new supplement regimen. Now let's talk food. Certain foods can naturally boost your glutathione levels. These include sulfur-rich foods like garlic, onions, and cruciferous vegetables, as well as foods rich in selenium like Brazil nuts and sardines. On the flip side, there are foods to avoid, such as those high in sugar or unhealthy fats, as they can deplete your glutathione levels. Remember, while glutathione offers many health benefits, it's not a magic bullet. It's just one piece of the puzzle in maintaining your overall health. A balanced diet, regular exercise, and a healthy lifestyle are just as important. So there you have it, a comprehensive guide to glutathione. Remember, your health is your wealth, and glutathione could just be the key to unlocking it.